In this video, we'll be taking a look at three WNBA games happening on August 24, 2023, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games. So two picks for each game, six picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports. Let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three WNBA games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive sports picks to take your journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer our best single picks, parlay picks, and much more. Now let's get started. Indiana Fever vs. Seattle Storm The Seattle Storm and Indiana Fever face off on Thursday in a WNBA showdown at Gainbridge Fieldhouse. On July 30th, it was the Storm that were able to secure the 85-62. The Seattle Storm looked to play spoiler after winning six of their last ten games. The Storm are four games out of a playoff spot. The Fever have lost 18 of their last 23 games and have lost nine of their last 12 games. The Fever have the worst record in the WNBA. The Storm are 6-1 against the spread in their last seven road games and 2-6 against the spread in their last eight Thursday games. The Fever are 2-5 against the spread in their last seven home games and 3-7 against the spread in their last 10 games overall. The Under is 8-3 in Storm last 11 overall. The Under is 8-3 in Fever last 11 overall. The Storm are 6-2 against the spread in the last eight meetings in Indiana and 4-1 against the spread in the last five meetings. The Fever are simply getting the benefit of the doubt because they're at home, but I'm not laying chalk with the team that has the worst record in the WNBA. The Seattle Storm have been able to scratch out wins here and there lately, and they absolutely blasted the Fever on the road less than a month ago. The Fever also haven't won back-to-back -back games since June 13th and June 15th. I can't do it. So the Seattle Storm to cover the spread as underdogs is our full game side pick. The Seattle Storm are averaging 78 points on 40.8% shooting and allowing 84 points on 44.8% shooting. Jewel Lloyd is averaging 24 points and 3.4 assists, while Ezzy Magbiger is averaging 14 points and 7.8 rebounds. Gabby Williams is grabbing 3.6 rebounds and Sami Whitcomb is dishing 2.6 assists. The Seattle Storm are shooting 34.7% from beyond the arc and 77% from the free throw line. The Seattle Storm are allowing 35.5% shooting from deep and are grabbing 34.7 rebounds per game. The Indiana Fever are averaging 80.5 points on 44.3% shooting and allowing 85 points on 44.6% shooting. Kelsey Mitchell is averaging 17 points and 3.2 assists, while Nalissa Smith is averaging 15 points and 9.2 rebounds. Alia Boston is the third double-digit scorer and Erica Wheeler is grabbing three rebounds. The Indiana Fever are shooting 32.8% from beyond the arc and 79.4% from the free throw line. The Indiana Fever are allowing 37.7% shooting from deep and are grabbing 34.3 rebounds per game. Under the projected total is our full game total pick. Chicago Sky vs. Las Vegas Aces The Las Vegas Aces and Chicago Sky face off on Thursday in a WNBA showdown at Wintrust Arena. The Las Vegas Aces look for a win after winning 14 of their last 17 games. The Aces have lost just four games since June 11th. The Chicago Sky need a win after losing five of their last six games. The Sky are now one game out of a playoff spot. The Aces are 7-2 against the spread in their last nine games playing on one day's rest and 5-1 against the spread in their last six games following against the spread loss. The Sky are 0-4-1 against the spread in their last five Thursday games and 1-5 against the spread in their last six games overall. The Under is 4-1 in Aces last five overall. The Under is 4-1 in Sky last five overall. The Over is 4-1 in the last 5 meetings in Chicago and 21-6-1 in the last 28 meetings. Of course, the Las Vegas Aces have the ability to blow the doors off here, and it wouldn't surprise anybody. The Chicago Sky have been a mess these last couple of weeks. With all that said, the Sky are fighting for their playoff lives, and despite the recent losing stretch, they're still a talented team. This is a lot of points to just throw the Sky at home, and seems like a bit of an overreaction to their recent efforts. So the Chicago Sky to cover the spread as underdogs is our full game side pick.
The Las Vegas Aces are averaging 94 points on 49% shooting and allowing 80 points on 42.8% shooting. Ajay Wilson is averaging 22 points and 9.5 rebounds, while Kelsey Plum is averaging 19 points and 2.5 rebounds. Jackie Young is the third double-digit scorer and Chelsea Gray is grabbing 3.9 rebounds. The Las Vegas Aces are shooting 38.3% from beyond the arc and 84.1% from the free throw line. The Las Vegas Aces are allowing 34 0.6% shooting from deep and are grabbing 34.8 rebounds per game. The Chicago Sky are averaging 80.5 points on 43.8% shooting and allowing 83 points on 45.5% shooting. Holly Cooper is averaging 18 points and 4.1 rebounds, while Marina Mabry is averaging 15 points and 3.8 rebounds. Courtney Williams is the third double-digit scorer and Alana Smith is grabbing 6.9 rebounds. The Chicago Sky are shooting 35.8% from beyond on the arc and 74.8% from the free throw line. The Chicago Sky are allowing 33.5% shooting from deep and are grabbing 33.1 rebounds per game. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. Dallas Wings vs. Minnesota Lynx The Dallas Wings and Minnesota Lynx face off on Thursday in a WNBA showdown at College Park Center. These two teams just faced off on Tuesday and it was the Lynx that were able to secure the 91-68 victory. The Minnesota Lynx need a win after splitting their last eight games. The Lynx are currently the sixth seed. The Dallas Wings need a win after splitting their last ten games. The Wings are currently holding on to the fourth seed. There were a lot of heated moments between both teams on Tuesday and it will be interesting to see if that carries over in this game. The Lynx are 5-1 against the spread in their last six road games and 7-3 against the spread in their last ten games overall. The Wings are 5-2 against the spread in their last seven games following against the spread loss and 1-6 against the spread in their last seven games playing on one day's rest. The over is 4-1 in Lynx last 5 overall. The over is 12-2 in Wings last 14 overall. The over is 4-0 in the last 4 meetings. The Dallas Wings should be favored at home because they're the better team, but this line does a feel a bit strange. Despite their inconsistent play, the Lynx are still a playoff team, and they did just beat the Wings at home on Tuesday. The Lynx looked way too comfortable in the victory, knocking down 11 threes and shooting 48.6% from the field. This is a lot of points for two teams that just met. So the Minnesota Lynx to cover the spread as underdogs is our full game side pick. The Minnesota Lynx are averaging 80 points on 43.3% shooting and allowing 84.5 points on 44.6% shooting. Mappy Sakalier is averaging 21.5 points and 7.9 rebounds, while Kayla McBride is averaging 14 points and 2.1 assists. Diamond Miller is the third double-digit scorer and Jessica Shepard is grabbing 7.5 rebounds. The Minnesota Lynx are shooting 32.1% from beyond the arc and 80.3% from the free throw line. The Minnesota Minnesota Lynx are allowing 34.9% shooting from deep and are grabbing 34 rebounds per game. The Dallas Wings are averaging 87 points on 43.7% shooting and allowing 84 points on 44.1% shooting. Eric Ogunboil is averaging 21 points and 4.6 assists, while Sadu Sabli is averaging 18 points and 8.4 rebounds. Natasha Howard is the third double-digit scorer and Tierra McCowan is grabbing 8.9 rebounds. The Dallas Wings are shooting 31.4% from beyond the arc and 79.9% from the free throw line. The Dallas Wings are allowing 36.1% shooting from deep and are grabbing 39 rebounds per game. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyzed. Subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.